What you guys got another video here for you in this one we're taking a quick look at how to reset all of your permissions on your computer i see this quite a lot it's one of the most common questions i get from people when they're asking for help on discord and other places where they've gone on to some site watched some video and basically they've started to run scripts or start to run some application like Chris Titus text tool or other tools, and they will see that some of these settings are managed by your organization. And a lot of these are policies and registry tweaks and group policy edits that they have made to the system to basically turn a lot of this stuff off. And of course, people forget over the course of time what they've done, or someone may have done it for them. Believe it or not, there's actually people that will pay people to tweak their PC for them and they charge quite a bit of money to do it. And uh, to be honest, it's a bit of a scam. But anyway, let's get back to how we can restore a lot of these settings back to defaults. And you can do it with a batch file. It's pretty straightforward and easy to do. And uh, I've done this and I've left it on my Discord server. It's been on there for quite a while, but it's basically just a bunch of code here that is going to reset uh, the group policy users, as you can see here, and group policies and it will do then a, a GP update force. I've made a video showing you how to do this in full depth, but I just want to make a quick video for today. And again, you've got the uh, registry uh, delete. And what this is doing, it's uh, going to basically delete the HK current user, uh, software, Microsoft, Windows, current version, and then policies. These are all the policies that will be set in place. Same thing here, more policies. And you can see it's all policy related, which is what people are going to be adding to the computer, Windows update policies and so on. So all you need to do here is quickly run this here. You can right click on this and run this as administrator. And you should see something like that. It's now updating the policy here. And there we go. And it's uh, now been completed. Done. And that's it. It's that simple. That's all you need to do and uh, restart the PC. So I'm going to quickly go ahead and do that right now. And we'll restart the PC. Once we get back, a lot of those policies will be put back to default settings. And hopefully after doing this, your PC will be able to function properly and you'll be able to gain access to those locations that were blocking you in the first place. So you can see this changed here, the system's changed, and that's because policies have been changed on the computer. You'll probably notice a lot of stuff has come back, and that's because these have all been removed and reset back to uh, default settings. And if we go back here, and this was a heavily tweaked system, but if we go back here and look inside our settings window here, and I'll quickly just show you one here for quickness, going to go down to location and you can see that policy has now been removed and you can now toggle it on and toggle it off whereas you was locked out before and that's basically it that's basically how you can reset all of your policies on your computer back to default settings so you can gain some sort of control over your computer if you've been locked out by turning features off by using policies or scripts and things like that then you can use something like this to put them all back to default Anyway, I hope quick the video there. I hope that video has been some sort of use to you. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a quick shout out to my YouTube members. I appreciate the support and I shall catch you in the very next video. Bye for now.